approached, we, uh, we, we will be attending, but as it relates to actually participating in the program, no. But we will be mm -hmm. in attendance at the forum event. TIGERS is an acronym uh, which stands for Total Indexed Global Return Securities. Uh, these series of mutual funds allow investors to participate in the potential gains of international investment indices while protecting the principal at the same time. Originally launched in 2010 and 2011 respectively, the TIGERS A2 is linked to growth in emerging market countries while TIGERS A3 links to indices that represent the global agriculture and energy industries. Our primary aim of introducing these securities is to provide one way for local investors to use Barbados dollars to gain US dollar international investment exposure. Also lets them diversify their portfolio, increase their potential for returns, and to simultaneously protect their initial investment. Today's listing of these tigers on the exchange will allow them to be publicly traded, which has not been happened before because they were issued back in 10 and 11, as I said, which provides liquidity for initial investors and an avenue for new investors to get into, to participate in this issue. As a wealth management and investment banking organization, we're very sensitive to the lack of investment opportunities for Barbadian investors in today's market. And that's why we consider it our responsibility to bring innovative and exciting investment vehicles like Tigers to the marketplace. So that's one piece of it, and that is actually done by taking a certain amount of the money that's invested and buying into local Barbados government bonds that mature in that same five-year period. And at the end of that five-year period, those Barbados government bonds will actually give you a principal bank. Right. We take another part of your investment and we go buy indices and these are internationally recognized indices they're listed on the on major stock exchanges um, they're not linked to small companies and, you know like in different countries these are listed on major stock exchanges the indices that were created for other people to invest in so we're not we're not creating indices we're taking what's already in existence and we work with RBC in the structured products division to buy an indice an option on an indice for a five year period now, so those indices, as I say, are normal indices. You can go and find those in indexes that we link to on any of the stock exchange. So you can see, you can go online and see what's the price of that index today. What we're using RBC for is to buy an option on an index, a five-year option. And those you can't really buy easily. Okay, so together with RBC, we're able to create this structure for a tiger and make available to Barbadians, okay, international investments that with your Barbados dollar you could not normally invest in. So you never, you can never find an equity investment that say I'll give you a principal back in five years' time. Nobody knows, okay? So in this case, we can. You can say we're going to invest it and give it you back. And we also give you an opportunity to take advantage of international markets so that if those markets go up in price, you will get the benefit of that. So when you look at where your market has been in the last four or five years and see the deterioration, declines in prices, internationally, markets have been going up. The U.S. market from 2009, from April 2009, was really doubled. From a low in sort of, I think, March 8, 2009, I think the other day they actually said it had gone back to where it was in 2007, which means it had dropped to half where it was, so it means it's doubled since then. So if you were involved in the international markets, you would have actually made money. Sitting if you were involved in the local equity markets, you probably would not have made money. So the, this is about diver diversification. So we give an opportunity to investors here to actually diversify outside the base economy into something that's principally protected plus gives you an upside in international markets. And that's really what a tiger is, okay? We, we choose different indexes based on what we think is going to happen over a period of time. I think there's many reasons. I think, you know, people look at equity markets and even international equity markets. When you saw, if you were back in 2007, end of 2007, you said, well, what's going to happen in 2008? Most people would have said to you, well, we anticipate, because the market's gone up over the last so many years, we can anticipate it going up in 2008. What happened in 2008 and 2009 was the markets crashed. So people look at this and go, well, I don't, I'm uncertain about putting money into equities, right? international equities. And you've seen your own look, equity market go, and you're going, well, what's going to happen in, in, in our own market? And you kind of take this uncertainty from your own market and apply it to other markets and assume it's not something you're comfortable investing in. So I think, generally speaking, in the Caribbean markets, there's a reluctance to put too much of your money into equities that you, that you don't have any certainty. So people much prefer debt instruments, putting the money into the banks where they get a fixed rate of interest and know what they're going to get back at the end. This uncertainty about equities is what put people off.